Hey everybody, welcome back to the show. It is time to make some delicious food with Rob Feeney. Yes, and our sharp eye viewers may notice that this bottle is only half full. Not I want to fight, and they're both good looking. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Mission okay. accomplished already, Rob. Cafe, How are you? Cafe. First of all, congratulations. You just opened in the beautiful English Bay. How's it going? It is, uh, it's crazy. We just, we had a uh, winemaker's dinner last week with Chuck Wagner from Camus on the Wednesday, and yeah. which we've never done before. Look at this. Look at yeah. it. Are you kidding me? Oh, it's it is. You guys did a little bit of a sneaky open too, which you always do. You guys no. always just sort of do a open. No, you know, I, you know, it's funny. I was with Richard last night, Jaffer, the owner, and and it's nothing. It's nothing uh, for us. The way we we set it up is we basically want to. Uh, we spent a lot of time training and getting yeah. things going, and we, we really just want to get the doors open and open to our, and our customers. And start feeding people can. with that view. People yes. may not have noticed the massive patio there as well. We're not, yeah, wow, yeah, it's big. It's uh, it's close to 90, it's almost 90, I think 100 seats outside. Wowzers. Uh, it's about 160 inside. Look so, at that. Yeah, the patio. There's nothing like this in the city. I, I'm not I'm not kidding. I, no, it's we're really excited in so many ways. Like I said, when I came to Cactus, I've been with, with them, what, four years now? And I remember Richard, when he first sort of mentioned that this is something we may be doing, I was like, where? You know, like, yeah. and I knew what he was talking about, but nothing had been built yet. So, well, I'm I don't excited. Think, and yeah. we're making some okay, really interesting making? dishes today. First of all, uh, tell us about the wine before it's all mm. gone. Well, a little bit about, well, where to go. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I'm over here. Um, the whole idea, I guess, with being down in English Bay is this is a, this is a little bit of a, a, a different uh, restaurant for us in terms of obviously what we're doing. And having said that, you know, people can still expect to come down and find a lot of their favorites at Cactus. We haven't done that. Chicken They're, wings! Yeah, that's right. Chicken wings, teriyaki chicken, teriyaki chicken rice bowl. But the wine list is a bit different. What we've done, we've got about 15 whites, 15 reds. Uh, and every single wine that's on the list is is in or around uh, some form of water. So it could be a river, lake, or ocean. Oh, and This is something that Sebastian Lagoff, you know, our head our head yeah. sommelier with Sam Savari, they put together. It's worked out really well. What and an every, interesting way to go about a wine list. It's, and every single wine is by the glass. It can be purchased by the glass. So you don't have to commit to a bottle, mind you, we have. Um, <laughs> but, uh, Almost. Yeah. I'm not afraid of commitment. And so, yeah. uh, we're drinking uh, which one today? This is from Argentina. Yeah. It's, it's, it's a Sorrentes. It's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a grape from Argentina. And I just I was saying to you guys, what's kind of cool is Tilia is, is, is this tree, but Tilia means linden. Like so Trevor. Trevor. Oh, hey, Trevor. You got maiden. your own wine, buddy. Yeah. I'm I drinking a... Trevor Linden. <laughs> Doesn't sound quite Delicious. Cool. OK, and what if we got uh, so, over here? So again, so the wine list, so again, with the menu, there are some seafood options up there. I've got a, a really cool ceviche I put on. I've ceviche, got a, yummy. ceviche. Um, we've done uh, we've done a couple other things. I got a really neat butternut squash soup with a little bit of a scallop um, and uh, a little bit of curry foam. There's a sable fish that's on the menu, so we're kind of growing. Plus, we have the concession that's opening later, which is a different, which is a different menu I didn't altogether. I know you were doing that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This all. Why not? Why not? <laughs> so what I've done is. Caught, obviously, being, you know, us being, uh, you know, us, 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 but it's a great fish uh, and needs a little bit of a bite. Uh, this is typically when we talk about you know, Argentina, but this is kind of a Spanish style dish I'm making for you. And this, I'll get a little wine in there. There you go. Um, and, uh, the chorizo was thirsty. Yeah, it was. He was. How did I know? Oh, okay. Um, <laughs> but uh, the whole idea is to, 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 to take a fish like this and try to give it a little more flavor. So, so what we've done is on the top. So you what else? This is kind of a, in a French we call it sauce verge, but what we've done is taken sort of t t uh, capers, mm -hmm. tomatoes, some onions. There's a little bit of white wine in there. And with the liquid, what we've done is, this is baked. So it's, the, this, this doesn't hit any kind of, it doesn't so get fried. So it's half Vancouver. <laughs> 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 uh, it was just wait, Whoa, you just yeah, lob yeah. these things up. <laughs> This is a great dish. But it's baked, it's and um, <laughs> as I knock over the wine. Yeah. But, um, yeah, wow, you got it's me baked. that. Capers, you yes. You guys always, like, something Liquid happens capers. or I get frazzled. Link Liquid capers, yeah, and it's baked for about eight or nine minutes. And then, obviously, we want to give it an, uh, sort of a, a Spanish or a Italian, even Southern French feel. So what I've done is we've got some beautiful chorizo, and we're going to put a little bit of potato, yeah. which is a natural combination. Paprika, and then we've roasted some peppers. We're just going to finish Beautiful that off with the peppers. Too. So this is a very simple combination, and this is something that you know we're working with right now. So hopefully, maybe you're going to so see it. Back to the fish. Did you sear it at all before you baked it, or is it just baked? It's not seared. It's just you take it in the pan. Interesting. You take move. this mix that's made ahead. It goes on the top and mm -hmm. goes right in the oven. And what it does is it keeps the fish really moist. Okay. And then of course with the chorizo and the potatoes, which is a great combination of flavor. We're going to finish this with a little bit of this is arugula, right in there. A little, a little bit, bit of color. herbage. And I am doing, 
Herbage. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's I am parsley, doing by the way. Fennel <laughs> yeah. salad. What just, am I doing? You're just to gonna it? put a little bit of olive oil. Okay. Fennel is a fantastic veg. I love mm -hmm. it. Fennel, a little bit of salt, and some lemon juice. Okay. And I'll let you mix that I one. Do that. Work for and the oh reason why God, the reason why the fennel salt is crystal <laughs> that'll get, make what your arteries that explode. Wow, that's pretty that big. Thing. That's massive. Wow. I think I'll skip okay, that. One. On. Is that a crystal? It is too. Yeah. Just break yeah, it up break there. there. Oh, okay, so and then lemon juice. A little bit, yeah. So really fresh give, and crisp. Give about three of those lemons, and we're good. I'm just gonna heat this mix up and finish this. Heat I'm that just up gonna a little bit higher. Be double breasted. Oh wait, he's got that covered too. <laughs> Where did that come from? I don't know. I'm, like, I'm just know. looking to chime in. I've been quiet for too long. Can I not have? Okay, so I'm just gonna. A drunk this... co-host again. <laughs> you want to? Hey, I wish that everyone could smell this. Can I just sort of throw it? Smell a vision. All right, isn't that mm. cool? That's the sauce. So this is a great. Is nice. This on its own could be like a little appetizer, like yeah, a tapas. Sure so Michael, why don't I pass this to you? Okay. Actually, here. Wait, wait. what are we doing? Because I don't want to get anyone's way. I foresee disaster. No, just yeah. here. Take the plates out. Here, okay. Put them. Right. We're plating. Yeah, okay, I can do this. Plating. No, I only have okay, two. I only have two. It's okay. Here, let me. Over here. I almost okay. got Emergency. that wine. I'm going to toss the salad out of that. Okay. Why does it sometimes? You guys make me nervous. I'm so. We do not. It's just tossing the salad over there. It's no big deal. Here. Hang on a minute. I'm, I'm just... And scene. Okay, so. <laughs> okay. So while we're doing this, we're going to tell you you can check out the brand new Cactus Club Cafe that's open in English Bay and go to the website. To, uh, and if you want any of Rob's recipes, as you all do, <laughs> urbanrush at shaw.ca. What is the shepherd's pie you made? That's still been the most popular. We can do that the again. The duck one. We can make a fish version. But um, this. if this you want just the like recipe the line. for this one, yeah, it's turning into Iron Chef here. Yeah, I know, because this is what but happens. The countdown's on. Okay, I got it. Okay, and there we, we go. mess around Fennel. for half an hour. You can email uh, for any of Rob's oh, recipes yeah. at urbanrush at shaw.ca. A. Beautiful. What are we missing? The oil. There we go. Okay. There it is. Oh. A little oil around the outside. Oh. Beautiful. Look there we at go. That. <laughs> Done. You should think about this as Done. a profession. Seriously. <laughs> Done, Chef. Finished. We're going to take a break.